What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High, Pri High Priestess Intuition. Welcome to my Christ subscribers and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Scorps, and you enjoy my content, if you can ring the little bell by my soul tribe, I super duper appreciate you saying, saying, saying. If you want to be notified of future content, you guys, just smash the sub button, just saying. Um, this is uh, hashtag lower for the sign of Scorps. This could resonate if you have Scorps any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, Day, Moon, Hammer, Jupiter, Taurus. Um, I got one channel message in as I was um, meditating on your um, hashtag low of energy, and I heard being the bigger person. So I think when you guys are going to be the bigger person in a situation, um, or somebody you're connected to, however that resonates, but some kind of being the bigger per person energy, if that resonates. Thanks everybody for all the love and support to the channel. I just want to throw that out there. Every single like, subscribe, share. Um, Etc., etc., etc. I really appreciate all the love and support to the channel. You guys are just the best. You really are. CIA energy soon for one particular Scorpio. Okay, I heard CIA energy soon for one particular Scorpio. We have been pulling very, very heavy CIA energy in here. In Virgos, I had the same exact thing. So I heard CIA energy soon for one particular Scorpio. So you plug it in, how that resonates. That's Criminal Intelligence Agency. So, um, you, you know, you could be in the CIA or you could be dealing with somebody in the CIA. But heavy CIA energy, if that resonates for you. Spirit messages you have a sign of Scorps. A particular Scorpio is about to reveal information on a Gemini they never thought they would. Okay, I heard a particular Scorpio is about to reveal information on a. Um, Gemini, they never thought they would. So that could be positive or negative information, um, Scorpio. You plug that in, however that resonates, if that resonates for you. Um, some kind of information on a Gemini. That could have Gemini in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, and mid or Jupiter charts. Number 53 or 10 could be very significant numbers in your life in some shape, form, or fashion. 53 or 10. They could be significant numbers of you or somebody you're connected to. It could be um, a possible age, lottery number, um, date of birth number, social security number, green card number, or significant numbers you're seeing on billboards or advertisements, 53 or 10. For some, you could be dealing with a water sign because it's a water sign energy. If you are, they could have Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or North Node, Midhaven, or Jupiter charts. Seahorse Spirit, watch and wait. A particular Scorpio has cleared out a Libra out of their life. Okay, I heard one of you guys has cleared out a Libra out of your life. So that could be you clearing that person out and blocking them or them blocking you, but some kind of Clearing out, and it sounds like blocking energy of a Libra and energy. They could have Libra in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, and Midhaven, Jupiter charts. A Scorpio wants to get information to a Leo, but they know they're very, their guards are up. They're trying to think of creative ways to get it to them. They might mail it. Is what I heard. So you plug it in how it resonates. So a Scorps is trying to figure out um, creative ways to get, I heard information, particular information to a Leo. They could have Leo in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Venus, North, Femme, and Hammer, Jupiter, Masculine, or Femme, Leo. But I heard basically um, you're trying to think of creative ways to get it to this Leo because um, their guards are up. So I heard you might mail it. So you might snail mail it. So watch and wait. So I think watch and wait to see if the Leo gets the information. If that resonates for you. For some, it could be information on a water sign because this is water sign energy. Possibly. Um, I didn't hear that. Just, just my intuitive 
guesstimate and reasoning on this possibly, but you plug it in how it resonates. And a Scorpio is about to make a call to the CIA. Whoa, oh, such heavy CIA energy in here. Maybe one of you guys works in the CIA, possibly. Um, and I heard a, a Scorpio is about to make a call to the CIA. So one of you guys is about to communicate with somebody from the CIA. And some of you guys, uh, one of you guys is about to call somebody in the CIA. Um, maybe you work in the CIA for some. I'm just saying, possibly. That could be the watch and wait energy too, waiting on this person from the CIA, criminal intelligence agency energy. Clear your energy field. This phone call is going to create a series of chain events. Know this. Okay, I heard this phone call is going to create a series of chain events. Know this. So this phone call with this person to the CIA is going to create a series of chain events. Um, it sounds like it's very significant. Clear your energy field. Someone needs to sage their home. Very negative energies. Okay. Heard one of you guys needs to sage your home. Very negative energies. So some of you guys have had some negative people, dark arts type energy in your house recently. I heard you need to clear your space basically. Solitude. Think of being alone as meaning you're all one and in total harmony with everything. The greatest treasures are those that wait silently during your quiet time. A particular Scorpio is really valuing solitude down. They used to not like it. Okay, I, I heard a particular Scorpio is valuing solitude now. They used to not to like it. So... You used to like people, 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 people all the time, basically, but now you're valuing solitude. So for some of you guys, I think you might have gotten older or more, more mature, um, or you just, um, that's exactly what I think. I think you've gotten older or more mature, and you're val valuing solitude now. Um, and that, there's nothing wrong with that. Growing and maturing, there is definitely nothing wrong with that, for sure, for sure. Absolutely. So that's like Virgo energy, in my opinion, like the hermit card, like um, really going within, self-reflecting, self-caring, and, um, you know, taking care of yourself. Dark man, dealings or relationship with a man with dark complexion or hair. This person is about, is... Some already significant in the Scorpio's life. For some, they're about to be significant. Some going to help on a project. Some a roommate. Some a partner. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Does that resonates with you? I heard um, some of you guys, um, this person is a very significant person in your life. So um, for some of you guys, it's um, a partner. For some, it's a roommate. And for some, it is somebody who's going to help you on a project. Um, some, they've already in your life. For some, they're not in your life. Um, and I mean, and they're about to be in your life. So dealings or relationship with a man with dark complexion or hair. So they have dark complexion or hair is what I'm feeling according to the mess, um, the card. So for some, it's a roommate. For some, it is a um, going to help you on a project. And what was the other one? Um, something else. Uh, relationship. Relationship. Bouquet. Compliments from an admirer. A particular Scorpio is about to get lots of compliments. I want to say you got compliments from an, from an admirer and secret admirer. I mean, somebody has, I mean, that, that never happens. That never freaking happens. But it happened in your reading. 
So you have got double deuces, secret admirer energy, very heavily strong. And I certainly feel, you know, this is your partner. So for some, I mean, they're digging you, digging you, digging you extra deep, or it could be somebody else, just saying. But I certainly feel maybe the secret admirer energy is this person, possibly for some of you guys, just saying. But double deuces, secret admirer energy. You're going to sense who this person is soon. Okay. I heard you're going to sense who this person is soon. So your secret admirer, admirer you're going to sense who the person is soon. So um, compliments from an admirer. So they might compliment you, say you look nice, yazzy, yazzy, yazzy. Um, secret admirer, they're obviously your secret admirer. For some, I feel it is this person with dark hair or dark complexion. You plug it in how it resonates. Pretty good little reading. All right, let me see if I hear anything else, okay? A Scorpio is about to send a large donation soon to a business. They're very regretful of the past. Okay. Heard a Scorpio is about to send a large donation to a business. They're very regretful of the past. So you're regretful of something that happened in the past in some shape, form, or fashion. However, that resonates, um, and you're about to send a, I heard a large donation to a business. So you're about to send a large donation to the business because you're regretful of the past in some shape, form, or fashion. However, that resonates um, for you, if that resonates. And a Scorpio is about to betray a Pisces in a huge way. They, this Pisces has betrayed them time after time after time after time after time after time after time, after time again. Okay, so you plug in and how it resonates, dear God. And I heard a Scorpio is about to betray a Pisces. I heard uh, basically Pisces has betrayed you a ton of freaking times in the past, but you're about to betray them. I mean, that's... That's not real. I hope that's not an actual relationship. I don't know if it's a friendship. Um, I hope it's not an actual relationship because that's not a real relationship. Um, it might be a friendship, a friend of me type thing. I don't know. You plug it in how it resonates, but you're going to betray them in some shape, form, or fashion. However, that resonates. All right, you guys. I love you guys so much. Um, everybody um, have a wonderful day. And namaste.